So in 1994, um, most people didn't know what an IPA was. It was, uh, you know, one of those uh, English styles that, you know, it really wasn't out there. Uh, a few breweries brewed an IPA, but usually seasonal. Um, we never intended to have one particular beer as our flagship, but we started with our IPA and it just continued. It was, it, it was never meant to be a one-trick pony, as uh, Brian used to call it. Um, you know, but uh, today, whenever somebody asks for a diamond knot, well, chances are they're asking for an IPA. Even though we drew, brew, you know, 20 different beers, uh, our flagship beer has always been our IPA. And then, of course, we had to keep up with the Joneses whenever the double IPAs came out. And so, uh, but still, today, 18 years later, uh, that same beer is uh, is our number one seller. I mean, it's, it's total, you know, speculation. But given that we were one of the first one of the first ones to do on year round and sort of set it as our flagship beer, um, certainly not to say that everyone copied us or anything of that nature. But the IPAs have obviously proliferated hugely. Uh, in, the, in the following years, so we like to think maybe we had something to do with starting that. <laughs>